Hey guys, just uh, tuning in for another video here of another boiler system build. Uh, this one's going to be a three zone baseboard system with a combi unit from Navian. Um, basically what I'm doing here is just kind of do my initial layout and then what I'd like to do to get everything out of the way is install all of the domestic hot water connections, uh, the primary manifold, my air separator, all the things that I know are very standard to the way I build these. Um, and you know after doing a lot of them I really have it down to quite a science and you know a very good process for how I install things just to speed things up so um, at this point like I said I have all these uh, service valves connected um, in some of my other videos I actually explain what all this stuff does so go ahead and check those out uh, just check out my channel and you can dig through a bunch of uh, the boiler build systems and some of them I go really in depth about explaining what each component does and how I go about setting these up. So uh, at this point in the build, like I said, I'm just setting up these initial things that are uh, always pretty straightforward for a build. And then I start to lay out what I want this one to look like. So this customer actually uh, wanted the supply and returns to be over here on the left. The most typical system I do, if you have no preference, is actually have everything go to the right just because of uh, the way things lay out. Um, that's the simplest method, but um, we could orient these any uh, specific way you want in order to fit on a, uh, a sheet of plywood. So this one will probably end up only taking about four by four. So I usually build my systems, adjust everything cordially, and then I'll cut the plywood as needed. Um, so I'm, I'm also in the process of just getting all my parts together and all of the other fittings that are required for everything. I have shutter valves for all the circulators all of my um, adapters that are needed. So again, this customer also wanted everything to be ProPress. So what I like to do during my builds is I also give the customer the option to go with whether they'd like to sweat their connections together, whether they'd like to use PEX, or whether they'd like to use uh, ProPress. So again, this customer opted for the press fittings. Um, so we can really build these any way you want. Um, and if you'd like an estimate or anything, just, just reach out. I'll put my email below and my contact info. So just, uh, you know, get a hold of me. Let me know what kind of system you're doing. So we do a lot of these builds for either in-floor radiant heat for concrete floors, a lot of pole barns, a lot of new, new construction slab homes. Um, and if you also have an existing system that is a little bit older, we do a ton of replacements for those. So whether it be baseboard, radiator, or air handlers, we can handle all that. Uh, and what we'll do is design a full system for you. Uh, basically, we just get inputs from you. Um, and if it's an existing system, what I do is I take your all the information from you for your existing system. And then I'm able to design a newer system for you that not only will, you know, at, at a minimum heat the home to the, the current comfort level, but we're going to save you a ton of money on fuel costs, whether it's gas or propane. We also offer electric options. So I'll be able to explain to you everything, the whole build, and also how much you're going to be saving. You know, it's it's hard to estimate dollars per month you might save, but we could talk percentages compared to your older system. Um, and if it's a new construction home, you're probably already likely expecting to get a, a f efficient system. But it's really those existing systems. I mean, I, I deal with people all the time that have a 50-year-old boiler or a 30-year-old boiler in their basement that's still just chugging along. I mean, the benefits from changing over something like this will be tremendous. Um, there's other options I, I offer, which are upgraded circulators, which will additionally save you more. There's different options as far as um, ECM circulators or variable speed circulators. But what I like to do is actually just get all your inputs, talk to you specifically about what you want, what your goals are, and then we'll build a system specifically for that. If you don't have a major budget and you don't want to blow all your money on a what I call like the Cadillac of boiler systems that I'm able to build, you know, we're, we're able to still build a system to meet your needs and to save you money long term. Uh, so if I if you want, like I said, my information will be in the um, description below. And if you haven't yet, go ahead and check out our other videos and subscribe to this channel because we have tons of different videos. We have a lot of builds we do. Uh, we do other work like uh, diff different construction jobs. We're building an entire new home. We have previous homes we've built. Um, so lots of video and content for you guys to enjoy. Um, so make any comments you'd like, contact me, and uh, we'll see you guys on the next build.